working on Scratch Junior, which is a programming language for young kids, specifically designed for five to seven year olds, and is designed with them in mind, so it's developmentally appropriate, and children can create animated stories, interactive games, collages, or anything they imagine. I like Scratch Junior because there's so many programs that you could make. It's like you can make your own movie. You basically get to make your own game and do it yourself. A few years ago, my research group at the MIT Media Lab introduced Scratch, a new programming language that lets kids ages eight and up create their own interactive stories and games and animations. And kids around the world have been making millions of projects with Scratch. A couple of years ago, we started a collaboration with Mitch at the MIT Media Lab to explore how we could extend Scratch for a version that's specifically designed for young children. Here's how the game works. You have to guess which one from this row makes which one from this row invisible. And you win if you, you, win if you get all three right. Computer programming, or coding, is like a new form of writing, a new type of literacy. Like writing, when people learn to code, they learn new ways of organizing their thinking, and new ways of expressing ideas. So when you learn to code, you're learning many other things. You're not just learning to code, you're coding to learn. Now, until now, people have generally seen coding as something very difficult, accessible only to a small subset of the population. But that's starting to change. We really think that coding can be and should be for everyone. We believe that learning how to code is a way to express yourself. It allows children to think in a systematic way. So while they're expressing themselves, they're also thinking about steps and problem solving and what comes first and what comes next, and that's sequencing. And sequencing is an important skill that leads to academic success. Do you know what that does? No, yeah, tell me. Makes it wait 50 seconds. Wow, how did you know? Yes, it's off. And it's set to 50. We design Scratch Junior to match developmental abilities of young children. We look at cognitive, social, personal capabilities, and we design the features of Scratch Junior to match what young children can do. We work with teachers, we work with children, we work with parents and we observed what they were able to do, what they were not able to do, and we went back and redesigned Scratch Junior many, many, many times, so it can really be a tool for young children. Being a teacher in an inclusive classroom, we have such differentiated needs, so this idea that there's an entry point for all the different kids in my class, regardless of where they're at with their learning, there's some way that they can get into it and start playing around and start learning how to create things, that there's a a point of entry for everybody in my class. We're now working on a version of Scratch Junior for the iPad, and we're really excited to get it out to the world so that young children ages five to seven can start following their imaginations and creating with Scratch Junior. Along with Scratch Junior, we are putting a lot of effort in developing materials and resources and other supports for both teachers and parents to work with young children and help them learn so that young children will be able to learn to code and code to learn.